You know the routine. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another very, very special episode of Full Drop TV. On this video, we got a very special review, as you can see already by the title. Yes, the Nike SB Sean Clivers. Um, I've been super excited to see these in hand and uh, actually, of course, get an on feet video because I do wear um, these shoes that I, you know, do reviews on. I did get some people wanting to see reviews of the on feet of the Nike uh, Dunk. Iowa. I was about to say a Nike SB, but it's not an SB, it's just a Dunk. Um, a lot of people wanted to see those on feet. I will be doing an on feet of those later, um, just not right now at the time. I wanted to do an on feet of these instead and maybe get some crease action. I did get some people getting mad at me because I did crease my uh, other SBs that I did a video on as well. But I just like to, you know, get people's reactions, see whatever they want to get from it. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this review. Alright, so as always, up close and personal, my personal size um, comes in this rainbow box right there. All around super, super dope. Of course, everyone wants uh, that special packaging. I would have hoped that these came with the special packaging, but unfortunately they did not. It just came in this box. But regardless, I do love this box a lot. Um, no matter what, you know, a lot of people say, some people didn't even like this for some reason. I just like that, you know, it signifies that these are special. There's something special in here that you do not see every single day. Um, so I did want to go ahead and, you know, do that for you guys. So let's go ahead and get into these shoes. There's so many details that are on this shoe. I can't wait to go ahead and get into it. So let's go ahead and do that now. There you have it. I'm trying to get, there you go. Finally focused on there. The Nike SB Sean Cliver. Man, these are so amazing in person. Um, I didn't know if, you know, the materials were going to match photos of these. And, because, um, you know, sometimes you see photos, they look pretty dope, but then you get them in person and the quality um, is complete um, crap. But, let's go ahead and get started first. On the back, you have the Nike and the gold stitching right there. Super dope hint. Um, then you have this kind of back uh, part of it. I was going to say back tab. There's no tab right there. Um, in silver or gray, however you want to interpret that color right there. I like that the Nike will pop, of course, on there. And then you have, going over to now the side of the shoe, you have this super, I don't know if it's, I guess it's kind of buttery, um, New Book suede right here. It isn't the most buttery um, material that I've seen, but it is pretty, pretty good quality. Now getting over to the side of the shoe, you do have that gold swoosh right there that wraps all around the entire shoe, um, which honestly makes it pop. For some reason, these remind me of like an Olympics Nike SB. Um, just because I feel like this would go so much good with those, it would tell a story. Um, of course, with the gold medal being the gold swoosh, but hey, you know, Nike SB can take that idea from me and use it next year. Um, or whenever you know the Olympics are gonna go ahead and reschedule but now getting on to the toe cap you do have that buttery leather right there super plush super buttery and of course you have that blue material that wraps all around the shoe right there again that super soft kind of hairy new buck suede that wraps all around then getting on to the top, you do have those really, really vibrant laces. I didn't really see them that vibrant in uh, in the pictures, but now actually seeing them in hand, man, they pop. And especially in person, they just pop. I would have liked it if it was 3M material. Um, it would have been even more dope to see that material right there. There you go, kind of shines on the camera. Getting up to the tongue, it does come and that again, Harry buttery suede new buck whatever you want to call it and it does have on the tongue Nike SB Cliver I want to say on the other ones it does say Sean so Sean Cliver next together now getting on to the bottoms I'm not a huge fan of these bottoms I know a lot of people love this design but I absolutely do not um, I obviously love that it's not white you guys know how I feel about those about white bottoms and how dirty they get but I'm just not a fan of this I would have preferred if the bottoms match the top, so it would have been a lighter material that was used on these. I would have absolutely loved that, um, but it does have a blue bottom right there. It's not really blue, I guess it's more 
of a greenish blue and then you have some gold flakes all around right here all right there and then I absolutely forgot about this but you do have gold stitching which is gonna be wrapped all around the shoe you can kind of see it it kind of looks brown on camera but it's gold it goes all the way around right there and then it did come with extra laces sometimes I forget these extra laces but you got gold right here that it comes with I don't I, I honestly don't like these at all I hate laces like this especially the material it doesn't feel like a normal lace it feels super weird and then you have white laces right here as well so now getting into the, my favorite part of the shoe I'm gonna go ahead and take out the insoles but before that I'm gonna show you guys the inside of the shoe because it does come with super amazing material on here so let's go ahead and get into that now Alright, so here we have the insoles. Now these are super special. This is probably my top three insoles um, that I've actually seen on any SB. So let's go ahead and get into the most boring one. I understand some people might not say this is boring, but out of the two, this is the most boring one. We got a blue insole with white snowflakes going across right there. And then you do have Sean Cliver in black and then Nike SB in baby blue. This one is actually really cool, of course. It's supposed to be the holiday special dunk, um, all of that good stuff right there. Now getting on to the other one, my favorite one, of course, um, has all the details on it right there. Of course, gonna be getting some B-roll for you guys um, so you guys can see all the details and stuff like that. All that right there. Um, it's honestly probably one of my favorites. I'm gonna say it right off the bat just because I haven't seen um, any other insole like this on an SB. Uh, maybe the Krampus, I wanna say, or Krampus. I don't even know how to how to say it, but I absolutely love this um, insole right there. Of course, it has the kids, the little elves messing around. Sorry you know. about that, I uh, my camera ended up dying, but again, you have all the little details right there. I will be getting some B-roll as I already said. I love repeating myself for some reason, but I thought this detail right here was pretty funny. Um, I didn't know exactly what it was. I still don't really know, but I thought it was pretty funny right there. The little details with the snake coming out of the jack in the box. Then you obviously have the skull right there. And then the Nike SB. Um, I said Nike SB, but the little panda coming out with all that right there. I know the friends and family pair does come with extra stuff on it. Um, so that's why they added those things in there. Came with like some stickers. Um, I would have wished to get the you know friends and family pair but unfortunately I was not able to get them so there's that and on the back you don't have anything too special or anything like that like I said on the Nike SB Grateful Dead you did have that on the back uh, same thing for the other one right there alright guys as always I want to thank everyone who has been showing love and support um, thank you for supporting us and um, you know I would love absolutely bringing videos like this for you guys I am going to be doing an on feet of these before I end the video and then after that um, go ahead and end the video so let's go ahead and now get into the very anticipated on feet of these take notes that video the on feet of course I always like to end my videos with some b-roll um, which I am gonna be doing here shortly but um, I just want to say thanks guys you know I'm almost at a thousand subscribers I really would like to hit a thousand subscribers before well, we of course end the year off I think we're at like 971 ish around there um, but I would love to have you know you guys get me to a thousand 
Um, and you know, thanks to everyone who has been supporting since day one. I just wanted to say a quick note. Please, please, please just remember to be kind to one another. Um, regardless, a lot of people have been um, going crazy over the shoes. Some people are really pissed off that you know they weren't able to get them. Um, and you know, a lot of people are gonna be mad tomorrow that they're not gonna get their hands on them. But no matter the situation that you're put in, no matter if you get an L, if you get a W, just make sure to show love to everyone. We get W's, we get L's sometimes. I've taken so many L's on SB's, I've had to pay resale on some of them. Um, and some of them I've been able to get for retail. But as always, make sure you are not mean uh, to people just because you know they have something that you don't have. Um, but I just wanna throw that in there. Um, put you know one and one together, make it two. Thank you guys again uh, for all the love and support. Until next time, peace.